Hey, what's up? Rizzo here, and this is Darksiders Apocalyptic Difficulty with Collectibles, and we finally made it to the boss. So swing your way back over to that door that we liberated from all the spider mini-bosses that we've killed, and we're finally going to make our way to Silitha. Now, she has um, a couple main attacks, plus she's a really strange boss because she talks a lot of crap uh, while you're killing her. So she teleports around the arena a shitload, and you're going to have to use the Abyssal Chain to get close. Uh, so when you get close, you just want to swipe it away at her for maybe two or three times, but then back away, and then she's going to start teleporting all around the arena. Uh, sometimes she teleports in front of you and does this direct swipe attack. Um, you need to avoid that. Sometimes she'll drop down above you, and you're going to have to get out of the way um, by dashing to the side. Now, if you're really feeling up to it, when she does both those attacks, if you can get behind her and hit her in that big spider pouch, uh, go ahead and be my guest. You're going to make things a lot easier on yourself. Uh, but if you want to wait and only hit her when she's not moving, um, go ahead. You're going to take her out that way. It's just going to take a little longer. Um, so you'll know that you're taking her down when she starts to teleport way faster and a lot more. Uh, she's going to start going crazy. So just keep um, whatever button it is on your controller to keep her targeted. You want to hold that down for pretty much the whole fight. So that way you'll be able to see where she's coming in and you'll be able to avoid her attacks a lot easier. So once you've done enough damage to her, she's going to teleport to the ceiling and uh, bring in these bomb points that you can also hook on to. So we'll hook on to those and then hook on to her and that's going to initiate the final cutscene. Um, but like I said, those are bombs and they're going to explode after a while and drop. Um, I don't get it on the first shot, so don't be afraid if you miss your opportunity. You're not going to have to go do more damage to her. She'll just bring up a new round of them. Um, so once you get her heart, you're going to get a full life stone just like you did with all the other bosses. But don't leave quite yet because there's a soldier artifact to be picked up in this area. I'll show you exactly where that is. Uh, so pick that bad boy up and head out and I'll see you in the next video where we're going to be returning her heart to Samuel.
start. You think he's going to let you live long enough to collect on your end? 